Hi, welcome back to the Unpetal Privacy and Security in Online Social Media, Week 5, Assignment 5. So here we are having 15 questions and the last date to submit the assignment is 28 to 24. So what are the outcomes of public, publicizing uh, police interactions on a X? Formerly it is known as Twitter, you know that. And here appreciation of the police by the public, increased trust in police, quicker resolutions of the public grievances. Next, as discussed in the lectures, which are the following campaigns on social media to create trust in the police backfire? So, my NYPD, my LAPD, and my Delhi police, all the above. I don't know whether to give a checkbox all the above or uh, four. So, all the answers are correct answers. As of January 1st, 2024, which of the following verification check marks are applied to law enforcement accounts on X? That is blue check mark. Which of the following attributes is the most effective in differentiating real police account from the fake police account in Twitter? So, verification status of the account. Analyzing the data without any preconceptions is called inductive thematic analysis. Which of the following is true about visualization shown below? Here, we are having some uh, green marks here. This is not heat map, I know. And the data used to plot the visualization is temporal data or it can be geospatial analysis. I think these two are the right answers. Coming to the seventh one, Saturday evening time between 5.30 p.m. to 6 p.m. Here, this is in a bold. Uh, what is the uh, actionable information is highlighted in bold that is temporal data and considering the first tweet there is a huge uh, path hole on main road kindly repair it address opposing kachiguda police station hyderabad this is an example of actionable in information as discussed in the lectures communication of the police with the citizens on social media is formal and what is meant by an engram that is a continuous sequence of an items extracted from text or speech corpus all students taking PSOSM and a privacy security on social media course are divided into groups of the students from each state of India. This can be best achieved using uh, uh, all the options are not, not uh, correct answers. As discussed in the lecture, which of the following measures of behavior can studied while analyzing communication between police and citizens on social media? Topic characteristics, engagement measures, emotional measures, social and cognitive measures. LIWC can be categorized on uh, input corpus into the following categories. Positive emotions, negative emotions, anxiety, sadness. All the options are right answers. Select the correct option while analyzing post on social media. Violence refers to the negative or positive sentiment of the post. Arousal refers to the intensity and sentiment expressed in the post. And 15th question, we are having uh, two types of communication. Uh, uh, first one, my vehicle and second one is uh, they are telling something about uh, here BCP, though I stay at JP Nagar, but being a KSFC layout RWA, I go to know that there are frequent. It is indirectly we are specifying, mentioning the problem. So, first one is direct uh, communication, second one is indirect communication. Now you can submit your answers. Once you have submitted your answers, it will show that uh, thanks for assessment is submitted and uh, thank you for taking the week 5 assignment. So, these, I think these are the right options. If there is any change in the, uh, if, I, uh, if there is an update in the answers, I'll let you know in the comments. So, uh, please check the comments before, uh, during the submission. Thank you. Subscribe the channel.